with qualifying complete, let's review our top three today. Ali, Leclerc and Max Verstappen. With qualifying wrapped up, we now have our grid lineup for the big race tomorrow. Be sure to join us then for what will no doubt be a fantastic race. Welcome to you from Azadlik Square, heart of Baku and home, of course, to the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. With high speeds, tight corners and few runoff zones, many are expecting a safety car here today. So our drivers will have to stay very much on their toes and hopefully away from the barriers. Baku City Circuit then, an unpredictable 3.7 mile track around the streets of the Azerbaijan capital. 20 turns for our drivers to navigate today, including the infamous Turn 8, one of the tightest and most challenging corners corners of the season. Now, Anthony Davidson, I wonder, might we be in for some early pit stops today from the midfield teams, all trying to put some pressure on or disrupting things for the leaders up front? If you're in the middle of the pack, you know, you've got your own race to run. I don't think they're going to be thinking about causing trouble up front. However, closer to the head of the pack, don't be surprised to see some split strategies. If you're running second and third, for example, bringing one car in for an undercut while leaving the other one out there longer can put a lot of pressure on the leader and maybe force them into an error. It's time to take a look at our starting grid for today's race. Ali lines up on pole position and it's Charles Leclerc in P2. Considering the rest of the grid, we have Verstappen, Gasly, Carlos Sainz and Bottas, Norris, Sonoda, Russell and Mick Schumacher, Hamilton, Stroll, Daniel Ricciardo, and Giovinazzi, Latifi, Giotto, Esteban Ocon, and Guan Yu Zhou, Eilert, Armstrong, Lundgaard, and Nikita Mazepin. Now, it's almost time for lights out, so let's go down to the track. <laughs>
You've just put in the fastest lap. Good job. the fastest lap so far? Well done. We're all ready for tomorrow's race, but before we begin, let's have a quick look at those who will be fronting the grid. Ali, Hamilton and George Russell. With qualifying wrapped up, we now have our grid lineup for the big race tomorrow. Be sure to join us then for what will no doubt be a fantastic race. Hello and welcome to the Ile Notre Dame once again for what promises to be another incredible Canadian Grand Prix and a fiercely competitive circuit where pole position can often be decided by less than a tenth of a second. We'll be seeing top speeds of around 210 miles an hour here at the circuit Gilles Villeneuve with around two thirds of the lap taken at full throttle. High speed chicanes spell potential danger, especially at the infamous wall of champions. And watch out for overtaking into the hairpin and the final chicane. I'm joined again today by none other than Anthony Davidson. Tell me, Ant, obviously there's a lot of development work that goes on with these cars between the races. You've been both a test driver and a race driver. What differences are there in the way you approach those roles? Interesting question, Crofty. They're two very different mindsets. I mean, when I tested for BAR, we had full in-season testing where per driver, you'd cover up to 15,000 kilometers per season. And in that role, it was more about working for the team, trying to help them improve the car and drive as systematically as you could, so that that data could be analyzed in the most consistent way. When you're lining up on the grid for a race, however, your frame of mind's all about what you can get out of the situation on that day, and the car's the tool to help you achieve what you want. 
You still want to focus on the setup, of course, but it's more about the here and now, getting yourself as far up the field as possible and less about development work for the future. It's time to take a look at our starting grid for today's race. Ali lines up on pole position and Lewis Hamilton completes the front row. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Russell, Sonoda, Max Verstappen and Leclerc, Norris, Sainz, Bottas and Daniel Ricciardo, Gasly, Giovinazzi, Nicholas Latifi and Mick Schumacher, Stroll, Mazepin, Luca Giotto and Esteban Ocon, Joe, Lundgaard, Armstrong and Callum Eilert. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out. Then let's see who can prevail today. After the points finish last race, let's aim to keep the momentum going. seconds.
Okay, we've lost the position. Ourselves down the place. So I'm coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content, and if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95. You all have a great day and peace out.